To your right, dazzling bright red orange birds, the scarlet ibises. Like the flamingos, the bright colors come from the carotene found in the diet they eat. These staging birds are housed next to the shorebirds. Looks like a, a pick up the largest collection of hornbills and toucans. It's made up of 25 flight aviaries, housing 18 species. Let us travel back in time with a dinosaur descendant. 
home to the world's flightless birds, the ostrich, cassowary, rear, and the emu. These birds are non flyers that can leap up to seven feet high. Your family can also visit the Dino Day for an archaeological experience and the paleontologist for a day. Flightless birds, like the Jonah bird of Mauritius, are extinct today due to the cruelty of mankind, environmental hazards, and the lack of breeding and conservation programs. We all need to play our part for the next generation of wildlife to survive. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now approaching the most spectacular and the world's tallest man-made waterfall in an apiary. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we have arrived at the African Waterfall Avery Station. Remember to take all your belongings with you and keep your tickets for the next part of the journey. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back on board. Let us continue our exciting journey with Slowly Riz. Did you know that two thirds of the earth is covered with water? You have seen most of the land birds in our journey, but many birds love water too. Like the penguins at the Penguin Coast, we house the world's largest captive collection of hidden macaroni, fairy, rock hopper, and humble penguins.